Hello everyone, in this FMInc web tutorial I'll be showing you how to use SyncMate by Altima Software to keep all your devices up to date with all your data, such as photos, song, calendars, and more. Let's take a look at the numerous devices SyncMate supports. You can sync other computers, iOS devices, and other phones, as well as your Google or Dropbox account, among others. Now let's say you have an iCal calendar here and you want to sync it with your Google calendar at work. How would we do this? Using SyncMate. You're going to click on the Add Connection button up here at the top and select a Google account and enter in your account details. Once you do that, you're going to see your Google account appear up here and with the option of what to sync. Let's uncheck contacts and check iCal. And here we can choose which direction we want it to sync. In this case, both directions. We want events from Google Calendar to be synced with iCal and vice versa. So we can get the same events in both places. And here we'll choose which calendars to sync. I'm going to choose an example calendar. And make sure that your Gmail calendar is selected here. Here you can also change settings on how much you'd like to sync, which events. And after you've done all this, just click Sync Now. And now, as you can see, the events have been successfully synced. SyncMate is great if you have an Android phone or another one of the supported devices here, such as a Windows Mobile or a Nokia S40 phone, because it allows you to sync things from iTunes and iPhoto and Safari bookmarks along with your contacts and iCal events to these devices which normally would have a much more difficult time doing if you had to use a different program for each of the phones. But one problem I did find was if I say was syncing to an iPod or probably the same problem occurs with a phone or something else. This is an example group I've created with some names in it just as examples and I found that they this group, example group, isn't showing up here under where I say sync only selected groups. I don't know if this is a problem or if I'm doing something wrong, but I've tried refreshing it a few times and it doesn't quite work. So that's one minor problem, but I'm sure if you sync all groups, it'll work fine. Just if you wanted to sync selected groups, it doesn't seem to be working right. One thing I didn't really find appealing about SyncMate is that if you wanted to sync with another Mac, you have to have SyncMate installed on that computer. But actually what I just found is if I go to SyncMate about SyncMate here, it says personal license for two Macs, which means if you have SyncMate Expert, you're able to use SyncMate on both computers with the same license, which means it makes it pretty simple for you to sync data between the two computers. I don't know what you do for more than two computers, though. I'm not sure. You'd probably have to ask the Eltima team about that. But other than that, SyncMate is an excellent application and allows you to easily sync all your information together and keep it the same on all your devices. And I recommend it to anyone who has a multitude of devices and needs to keep everything in sync. So thanks for watching this tutorial. And if you like this video, if it helped you out, Click the like button and be sure to subscribe for more. Thanks and see you next time.